All right, we finally got to the desired destination. Tumbia Bay number three. Um, the WAP is back and we're going to our new Germany home and we're... Did you say our Germany home? Well, yeah, because like... It's German home, our new yeah, German, German home. home. Like our new German home. The possibility of three years or two months, what is it? It's obviously probably two months. We don't know that for sure, actually. It's swell, ain't it? There's like static charges that we use, like. So tell me what. So tell me what are your plans now that you're in the new European country? Um, I'll play some basketball, work out, and help my brother. In what? You wanted help. In my, you want to help my depression or what? What? What do you need? What do you mean by help? Uh, I mean, help, no stuff. I'm kidding about the depression, probably. Uh, well, I mean, what else to add? I mean, let's see. Yeah, Frankfurt, Apple, and. Really not much to document right now, but other than that, the flight sucked. Uh, it was terrible. Uh, my headphones. Uh, I tried to use my headphones, but the, this phone that I'm using to record it has terrible audio quality, so it was just raping my ears the whole time. So I had to stop. And the food was really bad. I thought that it, it was like pasta panini or something stupid that was like a that. Real, that's a real definition of air food. And I thought. I thought the pasta panini was going to be something good, but it was just atrocious. And it was I thought it was going to be a sandwich. Pasta panini sounds like a sandwich to you? No, like, at first I couldn't see the thing. All I saw was panini. And I thought it was a sandwich. Well, anyways, other than that, um, yeah, the flight was like six hours long. And, and now we need two hours and a half to go home. Right now, like, I'm running on, like, two hours of sleep right now, and I'm, I'm kind of, I'm trying to chug it through two hours of sleep. Uh, when I was checking my passport into this Higbadiga airport, um, this freaking French lady, I gave my passport to the French lady, and this French lady was asking me all these questions, like, how long are you here for? And I was like, what the hell, lady? I don't understand your French accent. And I was so tired, I tried my best to be nice, but I could tell she was pissed off at the end. Well, I'm sorry, lady, but I can't operate on two hours of sleep when I've never done that before. So, yeah, kind of stupid from, we'll call her French lady agent number one. So, I don't know, that's just how some people are. They just, they're not understanding, you know. <laughs> I definitely know about that. Um, anyways, so Tumby, uh, what are you gonna do when you get home? First off, rest, and then get my basketball and probably check out the gym. The three gyms and pick which is my favorite. Will you be spieling cricket in Deutschland? I might, I don't know. Probably gonna be practicing the whole day. He, he thinks he's gonna be practicing basketball the whole day when he was, when he used to be glued to the computer back home, so I don't understand. He used to. Keyword used to. Big keyword. <laughs> I guess that's a keyword. Yeah, like, yeah, it looks like my teeth are yellow too, so that sucks. Um, I don't know, y'all. I mean, we made it uh, two months or three years. I don't know. We're gonna have to see. We don't know that yet. But thank God we're out of that crappy flight. I mean, the the dog food is still stuck in my stomach regurgitating all my acid so it's like screwing up my intestines but other than this other than that you know i think things are looking up well it's not as worse as dog food it's still bad all right i mean how did you feel about the chocolate the chocolate the chocolate was decent but like the chocolate nah i mean all right so